do not know what happened. <laughs> but welcome back to, well, this is still going to be part three of me playing the Game of Thrones Telltale's game. Earlier, I guess something happened with the stream and it shut down, but we're back. Let's see here. Let me pick up this key. I don't know what kind of key this is, but... Return the key. I don't know what it's for. Let me examine it first. I can't examine it. Oh, okay. Fuck that one up. Hmm. Is there anything else? I okay. You know what? I guess I. Huh. Pick this up. Takes you. Marjorie? Oh. Lady Marjorie is still with the king. I thought Maybe you'd want to know. Maybe taking the key to. Thank you. Mira, look. The other day when you asked Lady Marjorie for help, I only spoke out of fear for her. I want to help you if there's anything I can do. Your poor family. I can't imagine how you must feel. You're sweet to offer, Sarah. Thank you. Lady Marjorie is always saying how important friends and allies are in King's Landing. Just know, I will be here for you if you ever... My lady, I'll leave you to talk. Are you all right, my lady? The king was not inclined to offer help for your family. I'll need this mended. Gods. What? He said I was too easily swayed. And he reminded me that I am not yet his wife. I allayed his fear. For now. But it will be a long time before I can ask him for anything again. Nothing I said could cheer him. I'm so sorry, my lady. I should never have asked you for the king's help. Understand, it was my mother's plan, not mine. I just hope you can find some way to forgive me. This is simply not how things are done, Mira. Not in King's Landing. I'm sorry, my lady. Mm. <sighs> Soon I will be queen. And maybe then I'll be in a better position to help you. But for now, now, we must both be cautious. I must send a raven. I have to warn my family. If you'll excuse me, my lady. Alright, so how am I going to do this? Milady. Begging your pardon, Milady. I hope I didn't frighten you. I'm glad to see you. Thank you, Milady. I hope you saw. I was right before. About Lady Marjorie and Queen Cersei. I just want you to know, I... I can help you if you'd like. And your family. If you're willing to trust me, I hear all sorts of things. Things that could be useful for you. How can you help me? My problems can't be solved by what you might overhear. Which is why you must trust me, milady. You need allies. Hopefully I've proven I could be useful to you. I'm sorry. I... Hmm. I really must go. Please don't despair. I know people who... be willing to help you that's certainly interesting
Where's Sir Roiland? He should be here. The man values pride more than honor. We'll do without him. And without King's Landing. I know you'd hoped Mira could help us, but I'm confident we've enough strength of our own. Your men stand ready to act if needed. Our plan is a good one. It will work so long as everyone does their part. Isn't this a lovely pile of timber? Not the place I'd want to be if there was a fire. Ironwood is near impervious to flame, my lord. Is it? May I introduce Lord Ramsay of House Bolton? Son of Roos Bolton. Although a bastard, Lord Ramsay has the full authority of the Thank Warden you. of no, the... That's enough. Who is this little boy? Is he lost? May I offer you bread and salt, Lord Ramsay? I loathe bread and salt. Huh. Aren't you the little lord? Lord Whitehall told me you were young. <laughs> this. Look at you. A token for the new warden of the north. Let me guess. Forrester Ironwood. Carved by our most skilled craftsmen. Ironwood. Doesn't look like much. Your father will appreciate it, I hope. Our ironwood is highly sought after. My father is not so easily impressed. Such a dick. Not bad. Lord Whitehill, can your lot do this? Given enough time, we could learn. Given enough time, you could do a great many things. But not this, apparently. Look at that. More forester. Lord Ramsay. Come out where I can see you. We really must focus on the business at hand. What is it you want, Lord Ramsay? What do I want? Everything. Nothing. We'll see. First, let's see you bend the knee to my father, Lord Bolton. Warden of the North. Words are wind. Anyone can say they're loyal. Mm. My lord. Might as well do that. Ha! That wasn't so hard now, was it? Here's the thing. I don't care about your loyalty. God, this guy's the crown, dead. however, wants what you've got. Whatever you've been supplying the Starks for centuries. Ships, shields, Chamber pots. I expect you'll do the same for us. My father has promised as much to the king. You wouldn't want to make him a liar, would you? That wouldn't reflect well on me. You needn't worry. Your father will have what he needs. That's a good little lord. You can't trust a forester. They murdered our men. It was a forest squire who did it. One Whitehill soldier dead. One boy. Yet your man lived. He was within his right. They killed his family. His right? He killed a loyal soldier in my father's army. Then you welcomed me into your hall like a proper lord, hoping I wouldn't linger outside long enough to notice your pathetic little army. That sort of insolence from one of our loyal bannermen will not do. So I've come up with a solution that will benefit everyone. Ah, the Lord. The White Hills will be taking control of your Ironwood from this day forward. What? What? The Ironwood? But... That is our livelihood. Then you'd better well find another fucking job. You can't do that. <laughs> Why not? You know something the White Hills don't? We are talking about trees. You grow them, you cut them down. The White Hills had ironwood, once, but now those hills are bare. Hence the name. 
Of course. They know nothing of how to cultivate the forest. Look at their sigil, my lord. A barren hill. Do you want Ironwood for the next five years? Or the next fifty generations? Nice. The little lord does have a point. Very nice. We'll try this. Lord Whitehill will take half of your iron wood, and we'll see who fares better. But my lord... Half of something is better than the nothing you had before. To ensure there's no trouble, Lord Whitehill will install a garrison of 20 men within your walls. At Ironrath, that we cannot abide. Ethan. They'll help maintain the king's peace. And make sure there's no more trouble. White Hill men? Never. It's already done. You have a man you trust? My son, Griff. Griff will lead the garrison. You have no right. White Hills have no place here. Lads, do make this. Please, oh, man. Duncan, don't. Look at this little forester. You're not frightened, are you? Lord Ramsay, please. And you? Are you Lord Ethan's older sister? I'm his twin, my lord. Oh, twins. Well, like the queen and her brother. Well... <laughs> Hopefully not just like the Queen and her brother. Oh, no. I never had a sister. Always wanted one. Leave my sister alone! I have an idea. You'll come with me. You can be my highborn ward. Lord <gasps> Ramsay, that's enough. Do you like hunting? Let her go. She's quite pretty, your sister. We'd get along well. <gasps> I suppose you can stay. Bastard. Aren't you the bold lord? Oh, oh, what? No! what have you done? No! But I don't Ethan! want a bold no! lord. <laughs> Far too much trouble. Ethan! Ethan! No! 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 Even though you did bend the knee. I think we've come to an understanding. Lord Ethan! I certainly feel better about all this. What have you done? However, the foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. What the fuck? Take the boy as your ward. Kill him. If they give you any trouble. Lovely meeting all of you. We'll have to do it again sometime. Somebody help him! Fetch the mason quickly! You brought this on yourself. Mother! Please, stop! Don't let, let him take me! Go. Let him go! Stop that! No, please! Stop it! Let him go! Do something! Ethan? My son. What? What a fucking bastard. I don't even know what Ethan to Ethan sacrificed himself for us all. He saved Talia's life. He'll be remembered as Ethan the Brave. This house needs a leader. Lord Ethan named me Sentinel. I will lead this house. My sister asked you to swear loyalty to her son, and you did it without flinching. We can't let them hurt Ryan too. We have to stop them. We do not stand alone. There are those who will fight for us. Those who hold House Forrester above all other loyalties. Those who will not stop until Ethan is avenged. Until Ryan is home again, our house will not fall. We will be ready. Nothing comes without a cost, my lady. Are you prepared for what might happen? Shit, this got real.
Alright, let's see this here. So, 61% stay with Bowen. 62% loyal to the king. 48 freed Eric. Alright. That's something. 69 picked a Duncan as Sentinel. That means a lot of us realized that he was the right choice for the job. See, and. Okay, 49. So it's pretty almost even. We met him at the Great Hall. Okay. Shit. Well, that happened. <laughs> well, that was episode one, everybody. Damn. I was not expecting that at all. I really wasn't. Alright. See if we go straight to the second episode. Or do I have to choose it? And I have to choose it. Okay then. Well, that's happening. Alright. Well, I'm guessing now we actually get to meet Jon Snow, which is almost everybody's favorite from what I've heard. I for a second have to fix something on the stream really fast before I start this one. Alright. Let's go into it. for that load screen. These are dark days, I fear. The North Grove must never be lost. You're sending him to the wall? The boy's done nothing wrong. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. Duncan, I've decided to name you as my sentinel. I'm just worried about my family. The king was not inclined to offer help for your family. Are you willing to risk an alliance with the crown? It's a risk I'm willing to take, Lord Tyrion. Your mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother, Rasha. We don't want White Hill men within these walls. You can be my highborn ward. Uh, uh, Ethan. Uh, no! Don't let them take me! Uh, uh, son. this guy? Ah. That's Asher. Whoa, it, it's just me, Beska. <sighs> Took you long enough. The rail's getting warm. Or warmer, I should say. You can stop pacing. They'll be here soon. Huh, hookah. Alright. This place could use a good cleaning. I complain to the owner. Ale. It goes in yellow, comes out yellow. Waste time even drinking it, if you ask me. Considering we found it in an abandoned tavern, it's not bad. They smell off to you. It's the only thing in Yunkai that doesn't. I know. 
It's a filthy haven for thieves, murderers, and other deadly bastards. You should feel right at home. I know I do. May we drink, thieve, and fight until the end. You know, I'm not really a bastard. But you're my kind of bastard. It's half the reason <laughs> we're friends. Another round? Have you forgotten about our honored and exalted guest? Go see if he's still breathing. Huh. Okay, that's happening. How's he doing? <laughs> we need him alive to collect his bounty. After that... He looks fine. Fat and scared. Good. Let him stay that way. Until we collect our gold, at least. Eight hundred gold dragons for capturing him. Lucky we caught him trying to flee Yunkai. Lucky for us. Not so lucky for him. We should find more former slave masters with bounties on their heads. I don't need any more naked fat men in my life, thank you. <laughs> no one They that. say only the poor know how to really spend money. We'll buy the finest wines, the best whores. Sleep in a bed without fleas? Sounds nice, doesn't it? We've not been paid yet, Beska. Can't spend dragons you don't have. We'll have them soon enough. My point is, with enough coin we could do anything. Go anywhere. I could afford passage back to Westeros. To Ironrath. I've heard nothing from my family in years. You mean go home? They treated you like shit there. Kicked you out because you fell in love with a girl from the wrong damn house. Gwyn. A man doesn't choose who he loves. Your family should understand that. Westeros and its bloody houses. Who fucking cares? They're still my family. My brothers and sisters. They had nothing to do with it. I suppose that's true. Just remember, we have a good thing here. And any moment now, we're gonna be rich. Let's make a toast. To all of us deadly bastards. To family. I'm sure I'd agree if I'd ever had one. Hmm. Okay. Beske, I thought freed slaves put the bounty on Bazak. They did. With his own gold. So why are the fucking Lost Legion here? Is that Tazal? From the Volantis job? Maybe he's forgotten about that. You! I told you if I saw you again- Tazal! Isn't it funny how life brings old friends together? I'd cut your fucking throats! It's good to see you too, Tazal. Huh. Where is he? Where's who? Yo, he kind of looks like, um... Yeah. Four hundred dragons. They must be working for the wise masters. Forgot. And that's all you're getting. The bounty is eight hundred. You get four. It's more than you deserve. <laughs> Give us eight hundred and you can have him. Don't be an asshole now. We're all sell swords here. We are nothing like you. The Lost Legion are the blood of all Valyria. And we are done taking orders from whimpering pigs. Bloody hell. What? And we're done with you, too. Calm down, Tizal. We can still work out a deal. You two are going to be useful to me for once. Not bloody likely. The wise masters will hear how Asha Forrester kidnapped the venerable Bezak. How he wouldn't take less than 800 gold dragons. So he killed Bezak instead. Me? Luckily, we were there to deliver swift justice. So you steal the money and we get the blame. Ponte Osinas! Bojos me nomi jahoso kisikas! Alright, 
Who dies first? Who oh, wants to dance at the end? Kill them now! No one's more life. Here's one. Come on! She couldn't pass me! Be down. You owe me one. This reminds me of <laughs> that brothel in Norvos. That reminds me of. It reminds me of the guy who played Star Lord in Guardians of the Galaxy. You kill me, and the Lost Legion won't stop. Their way. We need to go. Come on. Malcolm. Damn. Oh. We have to keep moving. Malcolm, stop. Asher, I'm glad I found you, my boy. It's been far too long. What are you doing here? Your brother Ethan sent me. I'm here to bring you home. Alright, gonna have to stop that one there mainly because I get copyright strikes. Well, I might get a copyright strike or a warning whenever it plays the main theme. So I'm going to have to do a quick cut and start the uh, stream over again after that happens. <laughs> 